All or almost all of MDT features and results are generally exported and converted to an external file, which obviously has a series of advantages. One of which being that we can view the results or the form of the same externally without the program, such as, for example, the case of a longitudinal profile, point cloud, or even a surface. They are currently loaded to a surface viewer. Another advantage we have is that there is no need to use the same CAD file to view this data. We can create or load it in a new session. For example, we go to MDT, Surfaces, Current Surface, and select the file of the surface in question to see it independently. Another advantage is that we can also use these viewers within the program for a quick view or to conduct checks. We go to MDT, Surfaces, View Surface and use the basic tools to see results in three dimensions, where we can see that a cone has not been created in some areas. This is due to the fact we have included topographic points with zero height in some areas. Well, if we locate these points and know their height, all we need to do is edit the respective heights. Let us use a height of 372 as an example, and as we said, on editing the point MDT will automatically recalculate and update this surface.